Hello and welcome to Cut's Guide to Obtaining the Otter Mount Auto. To get this mount, you will need seven renown with the Ascara Tuscar, the Ascar and Harpoon, and Dragon Isles Fishing 25. It will also help if you have a fishing add on like Better Fishing, but this is not necessary. To get the Ascar and Harpoon, you will need level seven renown with the Tuscar. If you are close to level 7, consider turning in fish to curl. You get 100 rep for the first turn ins of the day for all fish except for Isle and Dorado, which gives 200. Each turn in is 20 fish. After that, the rep drops to 5 per turn in, but the Isle fin is 10. To get the harpoon, you need 3 pieces, one of which is the harpoon head, which can be found on the anvil in front of Arvik and Escara. To get the tattered sea vine, you will need to summon Fisherman Tinnick and defeat him. He is located east of Camp Antonidas. To summon the fisherman, you will need to collect three pieces on the ground. The broken fishing pole, torn fishing net, and the old harpoon. These must be collected in order and can be seen on the mini-map as small hooks. Fisherman himself is a fairly easy rare. Defeat him and loot the tattered sea vine. The last piece is the wooden pole, which can be found south of Brackenhide Hollow next to a tree. When you have all three pieces, return to Escara and talk to Tavio to collect the harpoon. Your next goal is to obtain a gold coin of the Isles. This is accomplished by being very lucky and fishing one up, or by getting 75 copper coins and buying silver, then the gold coins. This is best accomplished in a Lunker raid. These raid groups are typically found near the fishing hole, which show up on the map. You do not actually need to be in the raid group in order to benefit from one. If you loot a gold coin, congrats, you're done. For every silver coin you loot, that is 15 less copper coins you need to get. If you don't loot any gold or silver coins, you will need to get 75 copper coins. Additionally, remember to have good etiquette. Only use your harpoon and strength to pull lunkers to shore. Do not DPS anything but the rares. If you loot a conch, allow the looking for lunkers to spawn a lunker. Then if you have five conches, throw them in to spawn more lunkers. Once you have your coins, head to the Great Swag in Anaran Plains. He is in a cave toward the southeast side of the zone. If you need to train your coins up, do it here, and purchase the Immaculate Sack of Swag Treasures for one gold coin of the Isles. This sack should contain aquatic shades when opening, but if not, you'll have to farm enough coins to purchase another sack. Learn the toy, and head to the northwest part of the waking shore to the underwater bar called the Bubble Bath. Make sure to use the toy before you dive underwater, or there's a chance the debuff will not appear on your tune while dancing. If the bartender mentions your fabulous shades, head to the dance pad. Once you stand in the dance pad, your tune should start dancing and you will see the debuff, Dance Dance Till You're Dead. This has a duration of 5 minutes. This is very important, don't do anything. Looking at a map or doing something else can stop your tune from dancing, and you will need to leave and come back to restart. Use this time to get up and stretch. After 5 minutes, your tune will pass out and you will awaken in the hissing grotto next to an empty fish barrel. Click on the fish barrel and loot it to get ready for more fishing. Your next task is to fish up 100 flowfish. These cannot be purchased on the auction house. Head to Ascara in the Azure Span, put on your shades, and start fishing. Once you have 100 frigid flowfish, click on the barrel to fill it full of flowfish, and then head back to the waking shore. The next fish will not drop until you fill the barrel. Now you will need to fish up 25 Calamitous Carp. This is fished in the lava around the Obsidian Citadel, and as a note, you do not need level 17 renown, which is lava fishing. I found a nice area just southeast of the citadel next to a Tuscar that was free from mobs attacking. Once you have 25 Calamitous Carp, fill the barrel again and head to Algathar Academy in Thaldrassus for the final fish. A little bit southwest of Algathar Academy is a small dock that makes fishing the final fish, Kingfin, the wise whisker fish, fairly ideal. Just a warning, this fish can take a long time to fish, and gear with perception is of questionable help, but it doesn't hurt to try. I also suggest wearing the aquatic shades while fishing for any of these fish. Once you have kingfin, head back to the hissing grotto in the waking shore. This is where you woke up after dancing underwater. Fill the barrel one last time if you haven't already, then click on the barrel to place it where you picked it up. Once you place it, Otto will show up with a quest over his head. Complete the quest to receive Otto as a mount. Otto's mount special is super cute, and if you're wearing your aquatic shades, Otto will wear a pair as well. And that's it! Happy fishing and good luck! Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe if you like this video.